on this tour so far it's been the best vibes we've had ever it's really awesome plus i was actually walking around paris yesterday and i was thinking about just name any other band from let's say same genre maybe that maintain the same lineup for 20 plus years with inferno 25 with the other dudes is over 20 years i can't think of any band all the slayers cannibal corpses morbid engines they always there's always been changes you know so i feel super fortunate about that because it just it gives the band credibility very much the very center of Poland you know with the palace of culture being a building that was um, a gift from Stalin from uh, Soviet Russia to Poland in the 56 I believe everyone including myself society are very ambivalent about the very building because the connotations are you know obvious you know and they, they attach to the regime that we were um, a victim a victim of but you know standing there with two flares the blue one and the yellow one representing the colors of a ukrainian flag and just announcing off to war and having this building in the background i'm like it came out as a very powerful statement I mean, like, let's say 15 years ago, we were not that. And we were just, you know, a corpse Spain band without appetite for anything bigger than just, you know, lights and some smoke, corpse Spain, and that's it. I thought that um, I need more theatrics to express myself fully and to express the potential of the band, that we are extreme metal band and something beyond that. I know it may sound arrogant, but that's exactly how I feel, you know. I always look up to Rammsteins and King Diamonds and all those bands, you know, that, that kind of grew out, you know, from their uh, niches, becoming uh, um, the households for, you know, heavy metal or um, when it comes to the show and everything, it's just, it's always been a very wow effect. It had a wow effect on me, so I decided that, yeah, let's, let's push that direction. Eventually we do attract more people, but without compromising, you know, we're not becoming nightwish, we're just brutal, radical, and the message is not friendly, but I'm surprised how, you know, I'm, like, I'm thinking how far I can push extreme metal, and I don't really, I, I never thought of like compromising, you know, even when we wrote songs like Barzabel, which some people say it's a ballad, you know, it's still evil as fuck. <laughs> Parisians have always been one of the most loyal uh, crowds we've had ever. That's why we did uh, even our official DVD here in Paris in what, 10, 15 years ago. And here we are in Zenith, playing, well, there's gonna be over 2,000 people tonight. Big deal for us. It's been 30 plus years. So I, I do have that in the back of my head, you know. It's not like, oh, someone handed it to us. No, no. It's been fucking, fucking like a gallery kind of. Work, 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 dedication, dedication. And eventually it is happening. But I know my, like where it started, so I'm like, if we were like probably a seasonal band, we'd be talking to a dickhead now, you know, or like, you know what I mean? It's like, oh, we're big or something. I know where I came from, you know. Hey. 